Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're talking about physical exercise for removing belly fats. I've got a fantastic workout for you that will help tone your abs and get rid of that annoying belly fat. So, without further ado, let's get started. The first exercise is called the bird dog. Here's how to do it. Start on all fours, then lift your right arm and left leg and hold them up in the air. Make sure your spine is in a straight line. Then, lower your arm and leg back to the starting position and repeat with the opposite arm and leg, aim for 10 reps on each side. Next, we have the plank exercise, get into a push-up position, but with your weight supported by your forearms instead of your hands. Keep your body in a straight line from head to heels, engaging your core muscles. Hold this position for 30 seconds to start and work your way up to one minute as you build strength Remember to keep breathing throughout the exercise. Let's do this. Next up is the plank pose. Remember to engage those core muscles. Hold this position for 20 minus 30 seconds, making sure to keep your spine straight and avoid any sagging in your stomach area. Incorporating the plank pose into your routine is a fantastic way to strengthen your core muscles and improve overall stability. It's a challenging exercise, but the benefits are worth it. Remember to breathe deeply and focus on maintaining proper form throughout the entire hold. Keep up the great work. Now, it's time for the jackknife stretch. Lie flat on the ground and place your arms above your head while keeping both legs extended straight out from your body. Slightly flex at the elbows and knees, then bring them together over your chest. As if you're trying to touch them together with your hands overlapping over each other behindno, slowly return to the starting position, extending your arms and legs back out. Repeat this movement several times, focusing on the stretch and contraction in your core and back muscles. Remember to breathe steadily throughout the exercise to maximize its effectiveness.